I saw her, she was holding something in her hand. It was black, it was dark. As I looked, I didn't know what it was she was holding in her hand. It seemed to be curved. She was holding, so it was like a, a roll of something in her hands. As I looked at Mama, she made a motion, and whatever this was, it began to unroll. So I realized at that moment it was a ream of material, a ream of cloth. And it began to come out, roll out from her hand. She's still holding it, but it's rolling out. And I see it come down and, and then turn around and circle around the globe. As I'm standing there, it's circling all the way around the earth and coming back to where we were in Georgia in seconds. Then it went around again, a few degrees over, and again and again, till it wrapped the entire world in this black fabric. And I saw the words spelled out in front of me. I saw the words in my spirit, blackout. B-L-A-C-K-O-U-T, blackout. And then it dis the whole thing disappeared. So it didn't scare me in any way. I thought it was very interesting because the Lord told us to read the signs of the times. We have to be aware of what's happening because God is on the move. The devil has been on the move for a long time and he's about to get his just reward, his punishment soon. And God will work his victory through his Holy Mother. So we need to be attuned to the Holy Spirit and to the Holy Virgin. It disappeared. I wasn't totally surprised because I know of the prophecies of the saints and the blesseds and the venerables about a great tribulation and a possible blackout and an illumination of conscience, three days of darkness. I did not know what this referred to. My first thought is the three days of darkness because it was a total blackout of the world. There's also been other prophecies about the whole world will be reduced by Our Lady to a much simpler way of life worldwide. And that speaks almost directly of a breakdown of all electronics, which would make you think of the new EMP bombs that some countries have, even aimed at our country right now, which would not kill anybody directly, but destroy all electronic circuitry in the whole land. So in other words, all cell phones would, would go out and televisions and computers. It's probably the best thing that could happen to the country today, the best thing. 